Hello and welcome. How are you guys? I hope you are doing well. So today I'm going to talk about the second topic of the micronutrients series, which is about the fat. What is the simplest form of fat? It is the fatty acid. What are the types of fats? Fats come into three types. Trans fat, saturated fat, and unsaturated fats. The saturated fat is the solid fat. It is like the butter and the animal fats. And the unsaturated fat comes into two types. The monounsaturated fat and the polyunsaturated fat. The monounsaturated fats are like olive oil and avocados. And the polyunsaturated fat is like the flax seed and uh, oily fish. And under the polyunsaturated fat comes the omega-3 and omega-6, which are the essential fatty acids because the body cannot create by itself. The trans fat is the most dangerous fat because it is byproduct of hydrogenation process. What are the omega-3 and omega-6? What meant usually by omega-3 are alpha linolenic acid and decosa hexanoic acid and ecosa pentanoic acid. What meant usually by omega-6 are linoleic acid and gamma linolenic acid and arcadonic acid. What are the benefits of omega-3? Helps open up our blood vessels, lower inflammation and prevent blood clotting. The benefits of omega-6 is exactly the opposite of the benefits of omega-3. However, we have to balance the intake between the omega-6 and omega-3 so we can have the benefit of both of them. What are the foods that are rich of omega-6? The processed and refined food and fats like corn and soybean oil. What are the foods that are rich in omega-3? Oily fish and nuts and seeds. Can the body store the fat? Yes, it can. And that's a problem with the fat in the body. It does not have a limit of storage because the body can store the fat everywhere in the body. And there is two types of fat stored in the body. Uh, one called subcutaneous fat and one called uh, visceral fat. The visceral fat is the fat between organs and the subcutaneous fat is the fat under the skin. What are the other benefits of fat? It gives us the highest energy uh, per gram between the other uh, micronutrients because it gives us 9 calories per gram of fat. Helps balance hormones, helps transport vitamins that are fat soluble like the A and D and E and K. What is the recommended amount of fats? It is recommended to have 20% to 35% of the total uh, calorie intake and 10% of that from saturated fat. What are the diets that are high in fat and low in fats? The diets that are high in fat are like the ketogenic and Atkins diet and the diet that are low in fat are the Mediterranean diet and the Dean Ornish. I hope you liked and enjoyed the topic and found it useful for you. Please share it with others.